Yo, <laughs> digging the dreads here. True, but Helper, why are you coming to look at us? Hel helper, you, you are directly playing. directly into the camera. Don't worry about production. Sora! Kingdom Hearts. Sora Kingdom Hearts. Oh, I never hey, turned hey, the music on. Oh, well. That's all right. Bad streamer alert. Helper, how? You got a hand warmer? Multi-man melee 2. What a song. And as we go here, Trap Stuff is going into Falco. Honestly, this is a pretty good pick against Sora. That's weird. Helper's got... But Helper's got some Japanese letters in his tag. It's Japanese for cool. Or at least that's what the guy at the tattoo shop told me. He's fifth coolest? Yes. Okay. Is it Only 5% cool. Oh, it's fifth on it the PR? Oh. Maybe? I don't think Helper cares about One Piece. Okay. <laughs> God. Who who does? I don't know. I just angered like I saw, half of chat. I, I saw him tweeting about it a little bit ago. Oh my but God. One Piece is not here. Instead, it's Helper getting that first stock extremely handily with the F smash on the Falco Phantasm. Is that what? 4.2%? Jeez. All right. Finally. Trap. Yeah. Helper, oh, why do you keep doing that? Which side is he going to? It's a mini game. Yeah. Guess correctly. You I know, never but, will. But the thunder part, it's always just like, oh, look at me going under the stage. I wonder what I'm going to do. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to get you. It's I'm always gonna... thunder. You can't. Oh, I... no. Oh, oh. I would have pressed forward air. Yeah, might as well. I would have forward aired one of them all the way underneath the stage. <laughs> okay, here we go. Some really good coverage here from Helper, just playing so patiently. It really is true what Devin says, though. This is Falco versus Magic Falco. Yeah. Yeah. But then again... Sora can't do just forward air to like 10% damage. Uh oh. Yeah. All right. yeah, take this. Going to the right side. Trap Touch has not been able to find the what? helper mini game. Get out of helper here. helper losing to his own mini game. Did you see his shoes sticking out of the ice? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> his big Help fucking me. big old, <laughs> big old, big old Disney shoes. I, I don't think uh, Sakurai was like, no one's going to freeze Sora. That's never going to happen. It <laughs> did not account for that in the programming. Exactly. And that's one of those bugs you write off as not important. Will not fix it. <laughs> I mean, at that point, what is this? DLC number, like, 15? 13. Like, 13. Listen, they 13 spent darknesses. <laughs> He's like, it's done. Let it rock. They spent so much money just to get Sora in the game. You think they can squash bugs? That's right. They already spent all the money on that uh, Disney keychain right yeah. there. Yeah. Merchandise. Bro, you know, even Mario is not free of bugs. Oh. In the meantime, while we've been bullshitting, Trap Stuff has brought this all the way back. We were bullshitting? <laughs> I, I'm 100% serious on commentary at all times. Always. Yippee. <laughs> Yippee. I saw that last night. <laughs> okay, here we go. Helper just trying to get any position here. Barely missing the jab. Yeah, the phantom hit, unfortunately, and Helper is bleeding for it as the Falco cutscene combos are coming oh, through. Oh, here we go. Ooh, trying to recreate the magic of, of the first one, but just like Kingdom Hearts 3, can't quite pull it off. Damn! Just like Kingdom Hearts 3, you cannot reclaim the magic of the series. True. Uh-oh, here we go. Ooh. All right, nice little reversal thunder, but what are we going to see here from Trap Set? Oh, barely missed the back here. Would have taken it for all it's worth. Oh, misses the grab. Going to get punished heavily for it, but not quite dead yet. Helper's trying the same tricks over and over, and I think he's going to get really punished for it. Because yeah, Trap Set is, like, up one full sock. Yeah, and we've seen Trap Set, like, really start to use that reflector. And it's been shutting down a lot of Helper's options. Finally getting the Faraga there but not able to close out the interaction. And instead, it's Trap Staff finding the down tilt to get uh, win one. Yeah. No, Helper, I think, was just kind of losing the patience there at the end. But you know mm -hmm. what? A mental reset, and they're going to bring it on back. <laughs> so Somebody's going wild in the Dude, venue. We got some passionate gamers here tonight. You know what? Uh, I'm going to make a call right here, right now. So Sakurai, if you guys don't know, Sakurai has a YouTube channel. And I love watching his videos. It's amazing. I love getting his insights. Uh, like, think of what you will about Smash, but it's incredible to watch him just talk about the craft. His next video is going to be on Smash Ultimates. Oh, boy. I think he's going to take the opportunity to kind of hint at his next project. 
really interesting. I, that's what I think. Now keep in mind, it's not the next video he makes. It's going to be the next game concepts video that he makes. Oh, I thought yeah. it was the next one. Okay. No, he covers all sorts of different things. Yeah. Se separated by categories. He said, look forward to the next game concepts video. Oh, okay. All right, so the next one's going to be a grab bag on his cats. Yeah, sometimes he's... Oh my god, I love his cats it's so much. It's so cute! <laughs> Just like these combos are pretty F cute. Fukurash. Keep up in the air. I love Fukurash. Ooh, catching the Thundaga trap step at the oh. ledge once again, but unfortunately, Helper not able to close it out. This now is the most patient Valka I've ever seen, but you know what? Not patient enough to keep that first stock. Yeah, Trapsev did use the double jump to try and find some space there with the forward air, but Helper smacking him right out of the sky. All right, some good combo DI coming out from Helper, keeping himself safe right there. Only 85%. Okay, but Trapsef uh, getting that damage on quite quickly. That was a goofy interaction. Trapsef had the anti-air, but traded with Sora up air, and instead it's Helper who got the combo. Whoa. Whoa. All right, Helper just losing one of those lives quick, quickly there. Yep. Okay, but here we go. Nice little loops. Nice jab. Yeah, kind of oh, that would have been a nicer comp counter. Missed the loop a little bit, but did get the jab to start an edge guarding sequence. And just kind of scrapping here underneath the platform. Got to be careful that those Falco up tilts are scary. Yeah, you can just spam those and uh, get... Oh, hello. All right, some really good DI there from Traps Up. And, and a lovely counter. All right, Traps Up just shaking it off. Yeah, shaking it out, trying to you know, mentally reset. Now you got to deal with Helper with the... Uh, <laughs> That's never so not going to be funny. All right. Trap Seth getting the whiff punish there on the neutral air. Might be seeing another ledge trapping sequence. Obviously, Trap Seth not looking to go out and get edge guarded himself. Choosing yeah. to keep this uh, stage control using the uh, small battlefield platforms. That is the one thing that Traps Up, I think, has been playing quite well on, is that they are not going to challenge Helper offstage. Like, that character can come back from anywhere. It doesn't matter. Yeah, plus you're a spacey. You've got, you're, like, infamous for having a super linear recovery. Yeah, it's quite unfortunate. Oh, what are we going to see here? All right, great angle from Trap Up. That's one of the harder angles Whoa. to find. Not finding the second sweet spot down air, unfortunately. And almost dying to the Thundaga thanks to holding that F smash. I mean, what can anybody do against that Thundaga? Just hold shield. It's okay. You can just walk away. Just can't like walk away from Seth that. It's going to be walking away from game two. Okay. Uh, you know what? I love the reflectors from Traps up against that Blazaga. <laughs> like, it's it's so unexpected every single time. Yes, and I, frame one. And I think it's actually, like, conditioned Helper to, like, avoid doing that, or at least, like, throwing it and just getting back to Fireaga. So I wonder if that's actually going to be helpful in the uh, third game we're going to see coming up. Like, yeah, okay. already stuffing out one of their tools, which is a really good tool. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. The yeah. That up special would have taken us. The opening hit of the up special, <gasps> putting Trapsef in a tech situation on the platform. Don't that's close your eyes, Trapsef. You got a game to play. <laughs> Oh my god, he can't hear us. <laughs> okay, there we go. Eyes are open. Eyes open. We are focused and awake for this game three. Coming in on Kalos. Very good counter pick here from Trapsef because Falco does have a wall jump. He can recover from lower. And just Ooh, choosing to bait that out with a Firebird. Yeah, it's going to be good damage there thanks to that Firebird. Trapsef using the Reflector to try and find himself some space so he can make his way back into center stage. But Helper's pressure has just been phenomenal thus far. Another F-Tilt back off of my ledge. My goodness. And another gotcha. This should be another... Really? What? How did that not counter? I think a frame Sora's, too slow. I think Sora's counter only activates from the front, and the Firebird hit below. Ooh! So a great angle from Trap Set, but unfortunately, Helper is continuing to hold all the cards. Only 55% on his first stock. Score. Wow! Good patience not to follow. Instead, just going for the easy combos here. Yep, a great reset from Trapsef to get the percents back into nice. his favor and get in the stock as well. We've got a competitive game three. Okay, but Helper answering right back here with combos Ooh. of their own, but missing the grab, that's going to be a big punish. Another air dodge wait from Trapsef, but unfortunately not able to capitalize. 
And I wonder if Helper is going to start uh, snipping those out and uh, just mashing at a disadvantage. It is very good to actually use Slimdog in that situation to force traps up to recover low. Not going out to counter anymore, having learned their lesson with the first Firebird. Yeah, speaking of recovering low, I love the way that Trap Seth have, has no been way. angling the Firebird <gasps> against the stage to avoid the counter. All right, both just fighting for the ledge and not getting anything. I no ledge drum. I am shocked that everyone made it out of that alive, but Trap Seth not making it out of those loops alive as Helper converts into an F tilt, getting Trap Seth down to his winner side stock. What are these loops? I mean, Helper's, Helper's played Kingdom Hearts before. This is how you play. You mash the X button. We're, we're loop on the third right now? Ah, I did the third Ooh. game. Oh my goodness. Just Excellent barely getting catch. caught oh, by the Thundaga. No. Goal! <laughs> it's good! Aww, what a good sport. He's like, I can't even be mad. I can't believe that Thundaga hit and it killed? Oh, yeah. You, you know what everybody's going to be happy about? Everyone here, except one person, is going to be top 24. True. Oh no! <laughs> Only <laughs> Don't one say that. is Aww. not gonna make it. I made it. I lost my first round and I still made it. So no, we have a uh, 28 people in the bracket. <sighs> oh no! Some people DQ though. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Really? Ah. Oh, that okay. doesn't go with my narrative. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that's right. That's right. You know, when telling the story, you stick to the legend, not the truth. True. But the truth is, we have a fantastic matchup coming up. Heretta versus the guy who beat me in brackets. So we're only going to focus on Heretta here. <laughs> now, Randy May Crazy, one of the best up-and-coming links here in uh, New York City.